Hey guys, we got some news here. Uh, it came out a few days ago that Elizabeth Tullock has been cast as Lois Lane in the uh, Arrowverse crossover this year. It'll be an evolving Batgirl and stuff. So I think it's going to be really interesting to see her in the role. I haven't seen her in anything, never even heard of her before. So I think it's going to be cool to see how she plays us off. And I think basing her off of um, Jenna Duan, uh, Jenna Duan, I'm not mistaken, is that her name? Uh, the, you know, Jenny Tatum's ex-wife who is who plays Lucy Lane on uh, Supergirl. I think basing her off of that is like a, kind of an interesting idea. She does kind of look a little bit similar to her. I think it looks, she does look like she could be kind of her older sister a little bit. I, th I think that really kind of works out. I think it's going to be really cool to see her dynamic with Charlie Hecklin's Superman and Clark Kent. So I think that'd be quite cool to see that, um, to see how much she's involved with that. And it sounds like she's supposed to be involved in the whole thing. Uh, if we go check over her IMDb page here, uh, we check over here. There's not too much here. There's uh, she's known for the artist uh, concussion, concussion. I haven't seen those and Grimm and then uh, Chronic and stuff. So I haven't seen any of those. I've heard of Grimm. Heard obviously heard of Concussion, but uh, don't remember seeing her in any of the trailers or anything like that. But uh, so it's really going to be cool to see where she goes with this role. And we. Look at our IMDb page. Obviously, the latest thing is going to be Supergirl. Uh, Liz Lois Lane should be an episode for season four, episode eight, um, and it'll be 2018. But they also have The Flash listed here as 2014. And I was like, uh, it's Lois Lane, and that that's just, just a mis uh, misinformation here. That it should be 2018, not 2014. The Flash started in 2014, so she won't be. She'll be appearing in episode in season five, episode nine, which will be that part of the crossover. So I think it's really going to be cool to see where things go with this. So she has a few other things, Parkland and stuff. Never saw that movie, and I don't think any of the stuff uh, stand out to me in any of her credits here. But it's really going to be cool to see where things go with this actress and how she kind of plays the role of Lois. And I think she looks good for the role. And we're going to have to wait and see as to where things go with this and how she kind of turns out. So let me know what you think, guys, about this. Just based, if you know this actress from Grimm, what do you think about her? Um, and if you have anything that, that uh, you know, you think that really is going to make it, which, how she's going to do it, and let me know what you think. And uh, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out. I'm Captain America, here to talk to you about one of the most valuable traits a soldier or student can have. Subscribing. Sometimes subscribing is the key to victory. Sometimes it leads to very little, and it seems like it's not worth it. And you wonder why you waited so long for something so disappointing. How many more of these? You're still here. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, guys. Peace. It's over.